Hi, my name is Zach Fairchild. And I'm Stephanie Howells, and we serve with the AmeriCorps Urban Safety Project out of Wayne State University. We've been organizing an all-inclusive sensory garden at Scripps Park in the Woodbridge neighborhood in Detroit. And the project was really made possible when we got the mini grant um, for the inclusion project through the Michigan Community Service Commission. And this park um, is a community park that serves a diverse group of people from um, families and students living in the Woodbridge community. There's even a homeless shelter out of the church across the street. And it's a really busy park and people are really excited to see a community project come to, the, come to the space. My name is Sandra Conley Edwards and I am a recent alum of Wayne State University's AmeriCorps program Amos, which is AmeriCorps Midtown Urban Safety Project. And I did a lot of things including finding resources for the urban garden. It required me to learn the various types of plants and, and which ones had the qualities that we were looking for in order to allow someone to experience a garden using their five senses. We always were able to find um, a particular solution to whatever the situation was that would work for me and, and probably any other person who would come behind me with a disability. Hello, my name is Jamie Muirhead and I've uh, been blind since the age of seven months old. Hi, I'm Ava Johnson and I've been blind for the past 25 years. And as far as Spit Park is concerned, it is the neighbor to our library for the blind and physically handicapped. Some of us was asked about doing the garden and I volunteered to do it. What we did was came out here and had the uh, dig up the ground, playing in the dirt, so to speak. It was kind of fun. Of course, you better not wear no good clothes, because of course they get dirty. Working with the AmeriCorps Urban Safety Project, knowing that they are, you know, interested in doing something in the community, because there's so much um, land that's available just sitting there doing nothing. The garden is an ongoing project and we had our major work day on Saturday. But we still have a lot of work to go and we'll have um, continual work days throughout the summer. A lot of people feel that people that are visually impaired can't do things like that but you know get a chance to show them that yes I can instead of saying no you can't. You'll say well yes I can. I can do it too just like everybody else. Thank you.